The night hums with an unsettling silence, as if the very air is holding its breath. A chill wind whispers through ancient ruins, carrying with it the echoes of a forgotten past. Something dark stirs within these remnants of a once glorious civilization. These are the whispers of fallen angels, creatures of myth and legend forever entwined with humanity's greatest fears and darkest tales. Their presence lingers, a haunting reminder of what once was. They are beings of immense power, once bathed in celestial light, now cast into shadow. Their wings, once symbols of divine grace, now lie broken and tattered, a testament to their fall from grace. Their stories, passed down through generations, paint a chilling picture of rebellion, temptation, and the potential for utter destruction. These tales, etched in ancient manuscripts and whispered through the ages, serve as a stark warning of the consequences of defiance. But what led these celestial beings to such a fate? What could drive such pure, radiant entities to embrace darkness and despair? What drove them to turn against their divine creator and risk eternal damnation? Was it pride, jealousy, or a desire for power that led them astray? The answers, shrouded in mystery and veiled in ancient texts, offer a glimpse into the very nature of good and evil, of choice and consequence. These cryptic writings, filled with mystical symbols and hidden meanings, challenge us to look deeper into the human soul and the eternal struggle between light and darkness. As we ponder these ancient tales, we are reminded of our own choices and the paths we take. The whispers of rebellion are not just echoes of the past, but a reflection of the eternal battle within us all. Fallen Angels the very term evokes a sense of tragedy, of potential squandered and light extinguished. These were not always creatures of darkness, once they stood among the heavens, radiant beings of pure energy and divine purpose. But something shifted, pride perhaps or ambition took root in their hearts. They rebelled against the divine order challenging the very fabric of creation. A war erupted, a cosmic clash of unimaginable proportions. The fallen angels, outnumbered and outmatched, were ultimately cast out, hurled from the heavens to the abyss. Their exile was not the end. The banishment from the heavens marked only the beginning of a new chapter, one filled with darkness and deceit. The fallen angels, their essence warped by bitterness and rage, sought to continue their rebellion in new, insidious ways. No longer able to challenge the divine directly, they turned their malevolent gaze towards the mortal realm. They turned their attention to the newly created world, a world teeming with life and ripe for corruption. This pristine world, untouched by sin, became the perfect canvas for their dark ambitions. The most famous tale, perhaps, is that of the serpent in the Garden of Eden. This story has been told and retold through the ages, a cautionary tale of temptation and downfall. The serpent, often depicted as a fallen angel in disguise, tempted Eve with the promise of forbidden knowledge, leading to humanity's fall from grace. This act was not just a simple trick, but a calculated move to sow discord and chaos. This act of deception set in motion a chain of events that would forever alter the course of human history. The consequences of that single moment of weakness reverberated through time, shaping the destiny of mankind in ways both seen and unseen. The serpent's whisper, a mere suggestion, became the catalyst for an era of struggle and redemption. The fallen angel's influence continued to spread, corrupting the hearts of men and women alike. Their whispers of deceit and promises of power led humanity down a dark path, one from which there seemed to be no return. The once harmonious world was now a breeding ground for sin and malevolence, as the fallen angels reveled in the chaos they had sown. The world descended into chaos and wickedness, a testament to the destructive power of their influence. Cities crumbled under the weight of corruption and the bonds of trust and community were shattered. The very fabric of society was torn apart, leaving a landscape of despair and ruin in its wake. The fallen angels watched with satisfaction as humanity spiraled further into darkness. The story of the Great Flood, a cataclysmic event that reshaped the very face of the planet, is often attributed to the wrath of God, unleashed upon a world consumed by sin and spurred on by the fallen angels' manipulations. This deluge was not just a natural disaster, but a divine intervention meant to cleanse the earth of its iniquities. The relentless rain and rising waters were a manifestation of divine judgment, 
a powerful force that could not be ignored. This devastating flood served as a stark reminder of the consequences of straying from the path of righteousness, a consequence heavily influenced by the whispers and temptations of the fallen. As the waters receded, the survivors were left to rebuild their lives and their faith, forever marked by the memory of the flood. It was a lesson etched into the annals of history, a warning to future generations about the perils of succumbing to darkness and the enduring power of redemption. Throughout history and across cultures, stories of fallen angels appear time and again. They are the tricksters, the tempters, the bringers of chaos and discord. In some tales, they mate with human women, spawning a race of giants who wreak havoc upon the earth. In others, they whisper dark secrets, inciting wars and fueling mankind's darkest impulses. Their presence is felt in the shadows, a constant reminder of the fragility of peace and the ever-present potential for darkness to consume even the brightest of hearts. The stories of fallen angels offer a cautionary tale, a reminder of the importance of vigilance and the ever-present danger of succumbing to temptation. These tales serve as stark reminders that even the most righteous among us can be swayed by promises of power, knowledge, or pleasure. The fallen angels, forever bearing the consequences of their choices, serve as a reminder of the price of rebellion, the weight of pride, and the enduring power of hope, even in the face of darkness. The myths and legends of fallen angels continue to resonate today, echoing through art, literature, and popular culture. They serve as a testament to the enduring power of these stories to capture our imaginations and ignite our deepest fears and fascinations. Their presence in our collective consciousness speaks to a primal fear, a recognition of the potential for darkness to lurk even in the most unexpected of places, even within ourselves. Yet, even in the face of such formidable foes and the ever-present potential for darkness to prevail, these stories also offer a glimmer of hope. For if even celestial beings can fall from grace, then even the most flawed among us can find redemption. The stories of fallen angels remind us that choices have consequences, that actions have weight, and that even in the darkest of times the human spirit with its capacity for love, compassion and resilience can endure. And that perhaps is the most enduring message of all.